So as we start, today we're going to be looking at them posting with their hands. In other classes, we're going to look at them posting with their elbows. In some sense, it's sport jiu-jitsu. However, on the street, people will put their hands wherever they damn well please, okay? And if his hands are there, you're going to have to know how to deal with that, right? Like, so, yes, it may be less common, perhaps, but you're going to have to know how to deal with a whole range of places that people put things. Okay, so Elliot's here. I have my clothes guard, and I wanted to get him chest to chest, but he puts his hands above my shoulders. And as I try to pull him chest to chest, there's a space there. I can climb with my legs, but there's a space here. I don't like this space, okay? It could be one hand, it could be two hands. We'll start with two. My arms are gonna come up. I wanna go between his elbows and his shoulders, most, much closer to his shoulders. I'm gonna come over the top. My elbows are gonna to start to point up. I'm gonna to start to pull him down, okay? I am just trying to get under his arms. I wanna make his arms go in this direction, okay? As I get him, I'm gonna take butterfly grip, 10 finger grip, palm to palm grip, it's all good. If he's that small that you can grab your elbows, grab your elbows. But I'm gonna grab him and pull him down like this, okay? I wanna be up right where the shoulder meets the tricep. This is where I like to be, it's right in here, okay? If I'm in other places, let's say I go too low, he'll bring a hand to my face, yes, and he'll get right out very easily. If I go too high, he slips out. Every person, you're gonna have to adjust and find how you hold them so that neither of those possibilities is an easy thing, okay? I'm gonna be here, I come up, my goal is to, I kind of shrug my shoulders to take his hands off the ground. I'm keeping them in a bundle, but I'm really using the friction of my hands staying together. I'm not really squeezing very hard, okay? And just from here, I will adjust. He tries to bring the hand inside. I might move my head in the way, make that very hard. Yeah. I can move him, okay? He tries to get on the other side. I'll make the adjustments that I have to make. What's holding me together is my grip, okay? I wanna make that as friction-based as possible, okay? Not as squeeze-based as possible. That will make you tired too fast, okay? But I'm just gonna take this. It's artificial the extent to which I'm gonna hold him here, okay? I have no intentions to try to hold him there for 30 seconds or a minute, but I want you to kind of work for like 20 seconds and feel how you have to adjust to keep his arms bundled up like that. We're gonna to go to other possibilities, okay? But you just need to be able to hold them for a little bit and manage that situation. One, two, three.